Gao's Watch, Act 5, Scene 3. After the battle, the princess by the standard on the ravelin. Enter Gao with the crown of the kingdom. Gao, here's earnest of the queen's submission, this by her last herald and in haste. Princess, twas ours already. Where is the woman? Gao, fled with her horse, they broke at dawn. Noon has not struck, and your queen questionless. Princess, by you, through you, how shall I honor you? Gao, me, but for what? Princess, for all, 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 since the realm sunk beneath us, hear him. For what? Your body twixt my bosom and her knife, your lips on the cup she proffered for my death, your one cloak over me, that night in the snows, we held the pass at barge, every hour, new strengths to this most unbelievable last. Honor him, I will honor, will honor you, tis at your choice. Gow, child, mine was long ago, enter Ferdinand, as from horse. But here's one worthy honor, welcome, fox. Ferdinand, and to you, watchdog. This day clenches all. We've made it and seen it. Gao, is the city held? Ferdinand, loyally. Oh, they're drunk with loyal yonder. A virtuous mood. Your bombards helped him to it. But here's my word for you, the Lady Frances. Princess, I left her sick in the city. No harm, I pray. Ferdinand, nothing that she called harm. In truth, so little that... To Gao, I am bidden tell you she'll be here almost as soon as I. Gao, she says it? Ferdinand writes. This gives him letter. Yester Eve, twas given me by the priest, he with her in her hour. Gao, so? Reads. So it is. She will be here. To Ferdinand. And all is safe in the city? Ferdinand. As thy long sword and my lean wits can make it, you've naught to stay for. Is it the road again? Gao, I, this time not alone, she will be here. Princess, I am here. You have not looked at me a while. Gao, the rest is with you, Ferdinand, then free. Princess, and at my service more than ever I claim. Our wars have taught me, being your queen now, claim... You wholly mine. Gao, then free. She will be here a little while. Princess to Ferdinand. He looks beyond, not at me. Ferdinand. Wariness. We are not so young as once was. Two days fight. A worthy servitor to be allowed some freedom. Princess. I have offered him all he would. Ferdinand. He takes what he has taken. The spirit of the Lady Frances appears to Gao. Gao. Francis? Princess. Distraught. Ferdinand. An old head blow may be. He has dealt in them. Gao to the spirit. What can the grave against us, O oh my heart? Comfort and light and reason in all things, visible and invisible, my one God? Thou that wast I these barren, unyoked years, of triflings now at end. Francis? Princess, she's old. Ferdinand. True, by most reckonings old, they must keep other count. Princess. He kisses his hand to the air. Ferdinand. His ring, rather, he kisses. Yes, for sure, the ring. Gow. Dear and most dear, and now those very arms dies. Princess. Oh, look, he faints. Haste you, unhelm him, help. Ferdinand. Needless, no help avails against that poison. He is sped. Princess. By his own hand, this hour, when I had offered? Ferdinand. He had made other choice, an old, old choice, never swerved from, and now patently sealed in death. Princess. He called on the Lady Frances, was it? Wherefore? Ferdinand, because she was his life, forgive, my friend, covers Gow's face. 
God's uttermost beyond me in all faith, service and passion, I, if I unveil at last the secret to the princess. Thought dreamed you, it was for you, he poured himself, for you resoldered the crown, struck here, held here, amended, broke, built up, his multiplied imaginings for you. Princess, I thought, I thought he, Ferdinand, looked beyond, her wish, was the sole law he knew, she did not choose, your house should perish. Therefore he bade it stand, enough for him when she had breathed the word, Twas his to make it iron, stone, or fire, driving our flesh and blood before his ways, as the wind straws, her one face unregarded, waiting you with your mantle or your glove, that is the god whom he has gone to worship. Trumpets out, enter the prince's heralds. And here's the work of kingship begun again, these from the prince of Bargi, to whose sword you owe such help as may he thinks be paid. He's equal in blood, in fortune more than peer, young, most well-favored, with a heart to love, and two states in the balance. Do you meet him? Princess, God, and my misery, I have seen love at last. What shall content me after?'